Hello everyone, midday now. I just wanted to bring you an update here of today's session. No trades for me, all cash. Still watching a couple of stocks here. As I mentioned on other videos, I have USAT here and watch. I like this stock. Uh, this this is a pretty nice level here. So you notice 717, I'm still letting it run. Hopefully it doesn't bite me in my butt. Uh, the market right now is not the best in the last couple of days it's been kind of choppy although yesterday VLN was actually pretty good today uh, I had a bunch of stocks on watch but they didn't really work out the way that I was expecting NETS just pretty much went sideways let me just uh, bring you something I'll show you the five minute of a couple of different stocks that I was watching Getting a lot of steam, a lot of volume pre market. It was gapping up. I actually thought it was gonna be a good thing. Mike, this couple of levels here for the pre market highs, as you see there 279, 287. I thought, you know, after a breakout here, I was gonna be able to see this thing run up and break over the 287, which is the level that I really wanted to see break because this little pocket right here is too close. It's just a uh, about nine cents, eight cents difference, and I didn't want to get a trade in just to get a pullback for 287. So I was waiting for this to get inside of this pocket and then have the breakout to the upside. It didn't really happen. Kept it on the watch list anyway. AUPH, you know, pretty choppy here. It was getting a little bit, you know, move pre market. Then it started searching up after getting a little bit of volume right here. This found some support here and it's this reversal right here in this candle so it was moving up I thought it was actually going to be a good thing as you notice here we had a little flag here on the five pop up uh, another flag and then another pop but it didn't really work today it just the market is not responding so we saw KPTI this is another stock that I, I was watching I saw this thing popping up I thought that it was going to react in a good way but then just had to retrace and right now it's sitting on the 100 period moving average here but i don't really like it i'm gonna i'm gonna be out BYND. this thing surged up a little bit so you notice here getting a little bit of activity pre-market it was sitting on a 100 period moving average pre-market here then it, it had a pop went sideways pop flag then a little search here for the ones that were able to capitalize on this move here it's actually a pretty good thing it was a pretty good move but I was really not paying attention enough for me to uh, capitalize on the move here so I wasn't able to uh, get a trade in today again wasn't the best market for me so I just stayed out and Avon which had news yesterday was getting a little bit of volume pre-market but then when the time opened it just had a retracement I didn't want to short it I didn't feel too comfortable as you can see here we got a couple of different flags here very nice bear flag here testing the open of this candle which was 376 pop here here pull back from there again very nice formation and then from here had a high of 367 366 in this one here a spinning top candlestick which signify reversal again too but I uh, it's too close for me to midday so I didn't want to trade it it was past 1130 already but uh, the formations were really clean bear flag here very nice uh, doji right here and then reversal from here spinning tops coming right back down so it was a very nice formation, very clean, but again, I didn't feel too sure about it. So you can see it's flagging right here now. But um, I'm just going to be all cash for today, let it run. Tomorrow's going to be another day. And uh, I just wanted to bring you a quick update here. Hope you had a good day. Enjoy your rest of your day. Happy trading, guys.